Have you ever wondered how the city of Rome, an epicenter of Western civilization, came to be? Well, sit back and relax as we delve into the captivating chronicles of Rome, from its mythical founding to its modern day splendor. Rome's tale begins in the mists of legend, with its founding around 753 BC. The story goes that twin brothers, Romulus and Remus, sons of the god Mars and a Vestal Virgin, were abandoned at birth, only to be saved by a she-wolf who raised them. As adults, the brothers decided to establish a city, but a dispute over the location led Romulus to kill Remus. Subsequently, Romulus named the city after himself, and thus, Rome was born. But legends aside, archaeological evidence suggests Rome's birth was more gradual, resulting from the aggregation of nearby villages over time. This humble beginning marked the start of Rome's journey through history, its influence echoing through the centuries. The Roman Kingdom, the city's earliest governmental system, was soon replaced by the Roman Republic around 509 BC. It was during this era that Rome began to expand, with its armies conquering vast territories and bringing wealth and power back to the city. However, the Republic was not to last. The ambition of men, like Julius Caesar, saw the Republic transition into the Roman Empire a period of immense growth and prosperity for Rome. The city became the heart of an empire that stretched from the British Isles to the sands of the Sahara, influencing everything from language to law across its territories. But as the saying goes, all good things must come to an end. The fall of the Roman Empire in the 5th century AD marked the beginning of a new chapter for Rome. The city came under the control of the papacy and for many centuries served as the religious epicenter of the Western world. Despite the fall of the empire, Rome never lost its flair for art and culture. From the Renaissance to the Baroque and neoclassical periods, Rome remained a thriving hub of creative expression. Its streets and buildings became a canvas for some of the world's greatest artists and architects. The winds of change blew once again in 1870 when Rome came under Italian control. A year later in 1871, it was proclaimed the capital of the Kingdom of Italy. Today, Rome stands as a vibrant metropolis, home to international organizations and multinational companies all while hosting millions of tourists each year. So there you have it, the evolution of Rome, a city whose history spans over 28 centuries, from its mythical founding by Romulus, through its golden age as the heart of the Roman Empire, to its current status as a bustling capital. Rome's story is a testament to the city's resilience and enduring an allure. And it serves as a reminder that Rome, in all its historic grandeur, continues to shape our world in countless ways. The city's historic center, a treasure trove of ancient ruins and uh, architectural marvels, um, holds a UNESCO World Heritage status, further cementing Rome's significant place in global history. In the end, whether you're a history buff, an art enthusiast, or simply someone who appreciates the beauty of a well-told tale, Rome's rich history offers a fascinating journey through time. It's a city where the past and present beautifully intertwine, and every corner holds a piece of its incredible story. And as we look to the future, one can only wonder what the next chapter in Rome's illustrious history will be.